a lovely example of hematoid ferruginous hematite included quartz and uh, you'll, you'll find some specular hematite blades sitting on top of this formation too from the general Orange River region Northern Cape of South Africa. Now first of all let me put it flat to you like this so this would be your sideways view going right around now what we've used as a matrix or a base is this. You'll see the quartz crystals running through. It's actually floater quartz is sitting on this matrix, but uh, not a floater per se because the matrix would have been connected somewhere. Uh, Color-wise, we're looking at a gray to, to red. And in this case, not so much phantoms, but inclusions of little specular hematite blades. Under, under uh, uh, say, times 15 or times 30 magnification, you'll actually see little rosettes of, of hematite trapped inside this quartz formation. Dusting the outside would most likely be some feldspar or even some calcium carbonates. All the way from the general Orange River region, Northern Cape of South Africa. Quite an exquisite specimen. I actually see no contact on this guy. Or maybe a minor nick on that edge. But uh, I actually only notice it now that I'm really looking. It's funny, I often look at, when I've seen other people's collections, I always look for, uh, 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 I have to sort of uh, uh, tune my mind not to look for contact, but to look for beauty and aesthetic.